Hey guys, so today I'm gonna be filming something really different for my channel. I'm gonna be doing a trying wigs that I got off of Amazon video and they're all like super cheap. So I mainly wanted to do it because I thought it will be interesting to see if cheaper wigs are any good. But I also wanted to do it because as you can see, I've kind of neglected my hair for a while. I've stopped bleaching it. I've just kind of left it. And it's because I don't know what to do with it. So I thought this video would be useful for you guys to help me decide Decide what to do with my hair so I've bought a load of wigs in completely different colors like they're all in different colors all in different styles and I want you guys to tell me which one suits me the best you guys can maybe help me decide my new hair color so yeah I thought that would be a bit of fun and yeah I'm just gonna get straight on with it so I haven't even unboxed any of these yet I'm just gonna get like my first impression on camera so I'm gonna start with this one it was $15.99 they were all kind of around the 15 pound mark some of them a bit cheaper some of them a bit more but yeah, this one was $15.99 and it's a straight brown 16 inch wig. Let's just have a look. I really want to see what I look like with brown hair because I have been so tempted to just go all brown. Like I'm really tempted. Okay, this, ooh, it's like sticking to me. They're, they're going to be so static, aren't they? Where they've been in those bags. That's not the sort of brown that I thought it was going to be. That's a very like, what is it? It's like an auburn. Yeah, I think that's the right name for it. Or maybe it's not. Okay, I'm so confused right now. It's in like a flipping fishing net. What's going on? Get out. Okay, there we go. Have I broken it? I think this is the thing that goes over my hair before I meant to put it on. But yeah, this is what it looks like. It actually feels pretty good quality. Like that feels like an all right wig. And it's got some nice like layers chopped into it. It's got the black roots and then it goes down into this kind of auburn color, I think. But I don't mind. I do actually quite like how this looks and I really love the color. Okay, this is what the first one looks like. <laughs> I have it in my mouth, it's like going everywhere. I don't hate it, but I don't think this color suits me. Oh my goodness, it's molting quite a lot. Yeah, I don't know, I think it's such a pretty color, but I just don't think it suits me. And more to the point, I don't think long hair suits me. I just think shorter hair looks better on me, which is a shame because most of these wigs were long, but it was really hard to find like medium length hair wigs. So that's why I've gotten like a load of long ones. But yeah, I don't know, let me know what you guys think. But it is a nice wig, it is a really good one. Okay. So the next one is a black and purple, super long curly wig. And this one was $14.99. So sort of like the same price as the last one, but yeah, I'm really excited to see this one. Okay, I've actually always wanted purple hair. Like, I don't know if it's gonna suit me, but this color is so pretty. Like that is such a nice purple and it feels like good quality. Look at those curls, like geez, I could never get my actual hair to look that nice. Like they all seem to have dark roots, but I quite like that. I think it looks cool. And yeah, it's just got this purple mixed in with a few white bits I don't know if you can see them feels really good quality and I think I think it's really pretty this one is so cool but it is just so damn long like I just don't think longer hair suits me it looks so pretty on some people but I don't think it suits me but I like it like this one's so cool I like that it's curly and I love the color I think it's such a pretty color I don't know I'm kind of considering having purple hair for a bit but in my own length but let me know what you guys think if purple suits me I would love to know. And yeah, there's just a lot of hair. Like I can barely see out of it because if I look forward, it's just like, goodbye. Okay, so this next one was the cheapest of all of them. It was £6.68, that's so random. But yeah, this is the cheapest one and it's a orange 23 inch layered wig. I just wanted to see what I look like with really like fiery hair. <laughs> like I just wanted to see what it would look like. So yeah, let's have a look. I, I can't even see through the packet, so I don't know how bright it's going to be. <laughs> okay. Okay. This one is such a bright orange color. I'm so confused where the bit that your face is meant to be. Like <laughs> it just goes all the way around. Oh, it has a fringe. It does feel like a slightly less good quality, but it is the cheapest one. So what can you really expect? It's less than a tenner. It is a really nice color. I don't think it's a color that I would ever choose for myself, but I'm intrigued to see what I would look like with bright orange hair. So yeah, that is that one. I have a feeling you guys are gonna know my verdict on this one. Um, <laughs> the color is really cool. I kind of wish I'd got a slightly more ready toned one. I think it would be really interesting 
to see what I look like with red hair but you know this one's just like a bright orange it's a really cool color I just don't like this I tried turning it into a side fringe but I just couldn't so I've kind of got these like curtains going on and I yeah I just don't like the top half of it so the next one is a mint colored wig I'm gonna have mint green hair and I'm so excited this is a straight mint 22 inch wig and this one was 15.99 when i ordered all of these i asked alex which one he thinks he'd like me in the most and he said this one we'll, we'll see once i've tried it on but this is the one he said he thinks he would like the most oh my god it's amazing this one feels really long what and oh my god it feels like really good quality though this one feels so nice look at that color again i don't think it's gonna suit me but i wish a hair color like that blah, 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 blah. i wish a hair color like this suited me so we've got the dark black well this one's more of like a gray root and then it kind of like fades to a lighter gray down into the mint so yeah i'm so excited to try this one on okay so this one is definitely way too long it is the longest of all of them and it's kind of weighing me down a little bit and there's a lot of hair going on here like i feel like my face is too small for this kind of thing because I get lost amongst all the hair but color wise it is such a pretty color like I can't get over how nice this color is and I mean if I put it behind me then you can kind of just judge it on the color and not the length I don't know does that work it's not the sort of color I'd probably dye my hair like I don't think I'm cool enough for this but it does look really pretty so this one came in a box clearly very fancy and it's a ombre blonde wig and it's got a little fringe but I really want to see what ombre hair would look like although I kind of do have like ombre hair but it's actually just my regrowth but I want to see what proper ombre hair would look like okay this one has a giant label so just ignore that for now <gasps> it's really pretty oh yeah this is the wavy one quality wise it feels really nice but look look at that fringe like i don't think the fringe is going to suit me but i just loved the wave in this one i think it looks really pretty it starts out at a quite a light brown dark blonde and then it just fades out into a lighter blonde at the bottom so i guess this is most similar to my hair at the moment but it's still completely different i forgot to say this one was 18.99 and i think it might be one of my favorites apart from the fringe because i don't think that's going to suit me but everything else i think it might be my fave oh my god i don't even look like me i look so different with a full fringe i do like the whole brown into blonde kind of thing and i love the waves like i kind of really wish i had wavy hair and slightly longer hair maybe like this one's not too long i mean it is still quite long but it's not as long as some of them but i don't like the fringe like imagine it without the full fringe um <laughs> i just can't do i look so different this looks so weird it looks like i have a load of heads on my floor because they're just all laid out and it's really creepy what am i gonna do with all of these afterwards like seriously what am i gonna do <laughs> okay so the final one is probably the one i'm most excited about i saw it and i just had to have this one it is a little bit more expensive than the others well it's actually quite a bit more expensive but i couldn't resist it and i still think it's kind of affordable for a wig but it's definitely not cheap it was 34.99 but when you see it you'll know why i had to pick it so this is a what do they call it it's a pink wavy bob wig so it's kind of like a long bob but it's really like frizzy and wavy and it's pink i liked the look of it because it didn't look like a really bright pink it looked like quite a natural kind of pink color and you'll see what i mean it's like oh what is this this one has something extra on it how do i benefit from this i don't know anyway it's like a really natural pink color it's like quite peachy pink but it's so pretty like i would love to have my hair this kind of color but i don't know we're gonna see if it suits me and yeah it's definitely the shortest one of all of them it's probably sort of like my hair length at the moment but it's just really thick and wavy which i might never take this off i might put it on and never take it off so yeah oh and it's got the dark roots again i like it and the quality definitely feels the best on this one you can tell it's the most expensive it just feels really soft and yeah like really thick there's a lot of hair in there so i'm so excited to try this one on um <laughs> I look ridiculous don't I I'm so sad I thought this one was gonna be the nicest one but it just doesn't look right on me big frizzy hair like this doesn't look good on me if it was just a little bit flatter maybe like I don't know if I can straighten these I think it would look better if I could just flatten it down a bit because it's just a bit too much 
Color wise, I absolutely love it. Like it's such a nice peachy color, but it's just the style. It doesn't suit me at all. And it didn't look this big on the website or even when I got it out of the packaging, I wasn't expecting it to look this crazy when I put it on, but unfortunately it doesn't suit me. I'm so sad. I really wanted this one to look amazing, but I look a little bit silly, but anyway, I'm gonna take it off now. <laughs> So that is the end of this video. I'm now gonna go and try them all on, but you will have already seen all those clips because I'm gonna like insert them throughout the video. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know it was something a bit different and make sure you comment down below which one you think suited me the most or which one you liked the most because I would love to know that. And yeah, thanks for watching. Give it a thumbs up if you did enjoy it and I'll see you guys very, very soon. Goodbye. Oh my God, I can't reach today. I'm so far from the camera.